A warm welcome to everyone and namaste. Today we are going to discuss yet another interesting topic and that is for students. Yes, you may be thinking, so this episode is only for students? Now the question is who is a student? Everyone, all of us from the time we are born until we die, we all are students because there is a chance for all of us to keep learning. So if you have stopped learning means it is almost like we are dying. So it is important that in every stage of our life, we keep learning. We keep learning from teachers, we keep learning from parents, we keep learning from friends and even we keep learning from our children. Even they may be from younger generation, but they may teach us so many lessons. That is why I say mind and parachute both works in a similar fashion. How? Mind and parachute both works only when both are open. So similarly, we need to keep our mind open so that we can learn a lot of lessons in our life. So this particular five qualifications of student is discussed in Subhashita. So Subhashita is a book which contains lot of information, wonderful shlokas which is useful for our daily life. So one of this verse especially meant for students is this. So this verse says, Kaka cheshta bako dhyanam swana nidra tatai vacha alpahari grahatyagi vidyarthi pancha lakshanam. So these are the five lakshana or five qualities of a student. So we will go one by one by one and try to understand little deeper. So the first point, what this Subhashita is saying is Kaka Cheshta. So this is the first qualification of a student. What is this Kaka Cheshta? So in Sanskrit, Kaka means crow and Cheshta means its perseverance, the constant trying. So the crow does not give up just like that. And definitely all of us have heard the story of crow drinking water from a pot, right? So crow does not get the water, so it puts stones and slowly the level of water raises, then the crow drinks the water and goes off. So similarly, in our life there has to be constant perseverance, so continuous endeavor. So the moment we give up, actually we do not, we are out of the race. So it is very important that whatever we want to achieve, constantly, continuously we should keep on trying and trying and trying. That is why the saying goes, try until you die. So otherwise we cannot achieve success. So that is the point here. Kaka Cheshta means continuously, consistently we have to keep trying to get success. So I say there are three kinds of people in this world. So let us go in a descending order. So there are third class people, second class people and first class people. And what is the characteristic of a third class people? So third class people are those because of fear of failure, they do not even start any work. So the third class people, they think, oh, if I do this, oh, then if, what if I fail? So I have to invest, somebody comes and gives them the idea. So you want to make money, do this business, you have to invest this much money. So they think, I invest this money and what if I fail? And because of fear of failure, they do not even start the work. But people who are courageous, they invest money, they may fail or they may succeed. Even if they fail, they continue to do that until they get success. So this is the characteristic of a third class person. Because of fear of failure, they do not even start any work. And there are second class of people. So second class of people are those who start something goes on and on and on for some time, face difficulties and they give up. Friends, most of us, we fall in this category. What, what is this category? So this in this category, our second class people are those, we start something, go on and on and on for some time, we face so many difficulty and we become fearful and finally we give it up. So this is second class people. And what is the first class people? What is their characteristic? So the first class people are those 
who starts something goes on and on and on and on face innumerable difficulties, but they do not give up that is the characteristic of first class people. What, what do they do? They do not give up whatever may come in their path. That was one time uh, some enemies attacked and they stole something and they went back. So, it was Shivaji Maharaj all of you know the Maratha king. So, Shivaji Maharaj was there he said now I will go and find this uh, enemies and send them to the abode of death and people said Maharaj how can you find the path. So, Shivaji Maharaj made a beautiful statement he said if there is a path I will find it if there is no path I will make it. So, this is the first class people's attitude they, they are not fearful they are very courageous people. 